Hello and welcome back to SF, a Giants recap. And the Giants, they beat the Twins today, winning 7-1. to A great offensive showing from the Giants. And the pitching, they held up and did their job. So that's what we're going to go over in today's video. Make sure to subscribe and like if you do end up enjoying. But the Giants offense today, we finally saw everyone contribute. Or almost everyone. Patrick Bailey was the outlier here, which is kind of surprising. But everyone else contributed in some way or another. Either scoring a run, a sack fly... Uh, getting double, Brett Wisely had a phenomenal game, going 3-for-3, three three, uh, just a home run shy of a cycle. Uh, great performance from him. His swing looked fantastic today. Just a nice level swing, not trying to do too much, and he went with it. Single, double, and triple today. So great performance from him. Conforto, he had a nice double. Yeah, Soler had a triple. We were seeing some good at-bats, and everyone contributed, and that's what happens when everyone contributes. You get a good, solid team win, seven runs on the board, that's what you want, and the Giants, they really need to continue this strategy instead of just waiting for some miracle to happen in the later innings, and that only happens once so every so often. So this type of getting ahead early, adding on every inning, I think five of the innings, or five of the innings we added on, and we kept putting pressure on the defense, and that gets you a win. Not like the weak part of the Giants where three guys show up, they may be a couple of hits, maybe a homer, but then no one else shows up, and that was early in the game, and we lose by three because the Giants couldn't do anything. That's the type of games that have been happening so often that these ones are so refreshing to see because the Giants, they need to have the full team in it. Eight out of the nine guys today contributed, and that's what you like to see. Uh, now to move on to the pitching, though, Kyle Harrison, he pitched really well today. Only allowed the one run and five and a third innings pitch. Pitched really solid. He only got three strikeouts, but he's getting weak contact, a couple double plays, and that's what you want to see from a guy like Kyle Harrison, who may not be doing the best right now, but he's starting to get back up there, get his rhythm back, and his location was a lot better today. So it's really good to see. Ryan Walker, he came in, he ran into a little bit of trouble, no damage done, and he got out of all that. And then we saw Tyler Rogers come in. He pitched really well and got a nice clean inning. And then Kamud Ball, also like Ryan Walker, ran into a little bit of trouble, but got out of it just fine and got the win. And the Giants need to keep this up, not just show up one game and then go back to being flat dead in our tracks, just the offense not doing anything, the pitching struggling. We need to keep this going. It's not a one-and-done type of thing, and I've been saying this all year. The Giants need to keep it going, be consistent, and we've really had a hard time with that of consistency and the full team showing up. So hopefully the Giants can get that going and maybe get a series win, maybe a series sweep right here. So hopefully that can happen, and that will do it for today's recap. So thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time for a new SF Giants recap video.